I am Tilak. How are you doing? So what do I do? Actually what I do is I bust your chops. But not exactly that way. What I am trying to say is like, I am here to bring your life that is struggling or having a good one into true excellence in living. Excellence in living comes not by having. Having are actually byproduct, whether you have money, relationship, energy, idea. It comes unconditionally. And in order to have that, there are three different ways I open what I call three different blue carpets. They are not red carpets. Red carpets make you an ego blossom and you become somebody. Blue carpets are indications of your ability to cross from wherever you are into another place that can become much more higher level of consciousness, energy, fascination, excitement, so that you are experiencing your life as a pleasure of living and you are thinking as a joy of seeing and your power of heart as a true joyful exercise in conscience acts of power of giving, power of liberation, power of kindness and everything else to come out as a conscious acts of giving and see. How do I do that? Very simple, one way or the other you are tired and bored to a certain extent, otherwise tired and confused, otherwise tired and worried. Tired is because your body is not always in a state of lightness. Because body has absorbed so many kinds of heaviness that is there. That heaviness are residues, very simple residues. What kind of residues they are? They are residues of undigested energies. And how come you have undigested energies? Because you are holding them consciously to a certain extent. And the other one is you have taken in certain things that have not digested into your heart as an awareness or as intelligence or energy. So they are floating or they are sitting in yourself without actually totally assimilating, digesting and giving you energy and lightness. So as a result, one way or the other, you do not appreciate imperfection, impermanency and unpredictability. You are fighting with imperfection, unpredictability and uncertainty that comes as waves of wonder. So what I want to see and do is, I want to create in your heart a surge of energy and a lightness at the same time. And a lightness and energy to come at the same time is a very cool feeling. It means actually you are at ease with yourself. And that's what I do, what I call like a session. A simple session is almost like the triple A coming and giving you a battery, a charge to jump your car again. This will give a charge, a space of a ignition, an emotional ignition. Also at the same time unleashing some of the dark matter that you are holding. Because any of the dark matter you are holding is truly it's not your fault or other things the way you interpret. It is the pure absence of light. And pure absence of light makes you heavy and dark and doubtful, fearful, anxious. And so you are not experiencing life as a true invitation to dance and celebrate your life. So this will allow you uh, my session. That is a very simple session of uh, opening your heart and a space. So that actually you are like a strawberry dipped in now chocolate sauce. It's not just a chocolate sauce, it means a sweetness. Lightness is also containing sweetness, innocence. And also lightness contains the joy of seeing. So that will allow you to feel very good about being you. So most people experience when they work with me in a session, just the incredible lightness and a sense of a presence that they never felt before. Because you don't normally feel your energy, it is being covered with all kinds of 
in a dialogues that are running around. So when you actually can truly feel your presence, you feel happy. Unreasonable happiness, I call it, or unconditional happiness, meaning happiness without any reason or a source to come about. And that is what my sessions are about. My sessions actually put you into the flow again like a fish out of water is now swimming in the currents of the water again meaning creating your life to be effortless easy so that energetically you are able to function and see things for most people couple of sessions are the only things that will be good or that are in fact necessary my other work is about his journeys adventures in the path of liberation it is not to say some people are qualified and others are not. We are all actually in this life, we are made to become adventurous, rebels, great warriors, great sorcerers. Sorcerers is about finding the true nature, about reality, finding the truth about you. But they are daring. They are not for everybody at the same time. Maybe, perhaps it is for you. And they are almost not like swimming. They are more like scuba diving or deep diving into seeing the beauty. What is in silence awaits for your arrival. And you don't see this just to make money or to have something or to control other people or win a lottery. If they happen, you say yes in a humble way. Intensive journeys are journeys of adventure. And there are various different intensives that are there. Uh, I call them vision, heart, heart trust, and then others uh, like uh, 808 intensives and then uh, 010 uh, that I designed and delivered for a very few people after coming back from Sri Lanka. There are in-depth journeys of explorations in your consciousness. They are journeys that allow you to meet intelligence on the first face to face. They are appointments with grace. They are explorations into the deep wonder about who you are, what you are and where you are. And finding those three things will lift your whole spirit, not the way you have known before, bringing you a freshness and a deeper journey. The main difference between a session and an intensive, in a session it's like a motor car, it's, it's like giving you a car or putting you like a fish into the water, making your life effortless and good, which is great. Intensive is like a plane taking off, taking off from zero level is ascendance, is ascendance, is ascendance into unknown territories. Is an ascendance into an exploration of a deeper awareness and a consciousness for you to feel and see what awaits. It will affect your family and dear ones with direct hit called morphic resonance because once you are ascending, it will help, it will touch your wife or husband or your sisters or your family or your nieces, nephews, all the people who are dear to you. They are connected to your heart wonder. So as you are rising, it doesn't matter where they are living even, they will feel good because without any distance, your heart is capable of connecting, unleashing and ascending other people also into a great space. So the intensive is about actually taking off. Sessions are actually, when a session is given, from three days to few weeks, it will actually take you into a great place. But uh, when the intensives are done, all the intensives are between 33 days to 99 days. So uh, they are depending on what the type of intensive journeys you are doing. So between these 33 days and 99 days, you are also receiving sessions by the phone and also passwords, assignments, and various things that are like tools that will allow you to explore as you are gliding through the imperfection, impermanency and 
unpredictability, to see them as wonder, not as enemies or foes. This is a period where you will experience anyone you meet is a friend or a friend in disguise. So this is a very powerful space for you to create and design things that you have thought before and not done and also things that you have never thought before. And they are the new eye-openers that will come. It comes as a process of three things that will happen in the intensive. Number one is actually, it is one way to tell like a wake-up call. Waking up is actually a healing process. You are actually sleep with certain conditions cellularly or emotionally or mentally that holds you at bay. So you don't feel the freedom because physically and emotionally and mentally your capacity to touch intelligence is limited. Whatever the reason, whatever the conditions are, if you are waking up, like the Gulliver's travel, when your Gulliver is waking up, all the Lilliputs around him, they are just not going to have a chance of holding him down. So whatever the situation that is holding you, whether it is a virus or whether it is a family situation or whether it is an energetic condition, all the things, they can all disperse with three things that activate within you call heart dry, heart trust and heart awakening. They are the petals that opens during an intensive journey. These petals are normally open a little bit with the fascination and wonder that you have been able to capture in day-to-day -day life or in creative thinking or by the power of giving they have opened a little bit but with the incredible lightness going through your all your cells and your feelings you will your heart dry is going to wake up your heart dry will have full throttle for you to feel experience with time as a different space. You will be able to enjoy the hard drive giving you emotional ventilation, unleashing all the unnecessary energetic things that you are holding for dear life for some reason or other out of fear. When the fear disperses, what you get is emotional ventilation. Emotional ventilation is like a cool breeze touching you but it's a feeling of wonder, unconditional wonder that will come and will combust your body with what I call spontaneous combustion from a red fire into a blue flame giving you incredible energy without actually going down whatever the challenges, provocations that are thrown to you you will respond without having reactions to respond without having reaction will be a joy and a pleasure to you, something that is not normally happening in day-to-day -day life. And so in order to experience the wonder of what is this mystery, what is this magical world, who are you, what are you doing, what can actually you experience in the passage from known to the unknown, Known is actually your birthday, whenever you realize as the known. Unknown is your departure in this life. This period is the period of grace, period of wonder, pure love, pure life. And during this period, you have to experience not just actually what you have done in your life to do it better. You already have good time, you already have experience some sex, some energy, some success, some thinking and other. You are trying to improve what you already have. I am inviting you in the intensives to come and experience emotionally, physically, mentally, sensuously things that you never thought before. Have feelings run through your body, feelings run through your emotions, feelings run through your realization flashes of things that you never thought before that will delight you, that will bring you into a very, very deeper joy that it happened to be you who is you and you are not anyone else. 
and that will make you appreciate that you happen to be you and your family with all the imperfection of your whole family of who you are and what you are you will feel the gratitude running in your cells saying yes to life and that my friend you are becoming a sorcerer sorcerer means very simply put it lover of life lover of life a lover of life is going to sing song with the whole orchestra that surrounds you with earth fire water air and space they are not just physical element that is seen by your five senses they are feeling running through your body their energy is running through your body and that will combust it will be fireworks that you have never seen on a new year see what july 4 because these fireworks are the ones that will illuminate the world that you have seen before as black and white into technicolor in recognition of pure wonder and pure love and my work is an invitation for you to know that in this life you can have a damn good time my invitation for you is in this life you can make impossible possible thank you